Hello friends, welcome to the video lecture series on artificial intelligence and machine learning. I am Dr. Dafada and in this 22nd video class of AIML, we will understand the real world problems for the problem solving agents in artificial intelligence. From our previous video classes, we know that problem solving agents are a type of goal based agent that decide their actions by identifying and solving a problem to achieve a specific goal. And we also know that there are two types of problems toy problems or simple problems and the real world problems or the complex problems. In our previous few video classes, we understood different toy problems like the vacuum cleaner problem, the 8 puzzle problem and the 8 queens problem. And in this video class, we will understand some real world problems which are much more complex to solve. Okay, so let us start. See a real world problem is one that matters to the people and has practical importance. These problems usually don't have a single clear definition, but we try to describe them in a general way to understand their nature. Some examples of real world problems are route finding problem, which finds the best route to a destination, touring problem, which means planning a tour with multiple stops, the traveling salesman problem, which means finding the shortest route to visit multiple locations, and these three are similar to each other. Next example is VLSI layout design problem which requires intelligent placement and routing strategies of components. Next example is robot navigation which means navigating a robot through an environment. Next is automatic assembly sequencing which is used to find the order in which to assemble the parts of some objects. Next example is internet searching where the objective is to efficiently find relevant information on the internet using minimal resources and such many real world problems are there in artificial intelligence. First example is the root finding problem. The root finding problem is defined in terms of specified locations and transitions along links between them. The root finding algorithms are used in a variety of applications such as routing in computer networks, military operations planning and airline travel planning systems. Consider the airline travel planning problem that must be solved by a travel planning website like Make My Trip or Goaibibo. The airline travel problem is about finding the best way to fly between cities. The goal is to choose the best route based on cost time, number of stops and seat availability. Airlines must also schedule flights efficiently to avoid delays and within airport transfer if needed. And obviously the passengers want the fastest, cheapest and the most comfortable travel option. And for this airline travel problem, what are different states? Each state include a location and the current time. The first step of problem formulation is the initial state which is specified by the user's query where the user want to travel. Okay. Second step of problem formulation is the actions which is take any flight from the current location in any seat class leaving after the current time and also leaving enough time for within airport transfer if needed. The transition model will return the next state. The state resulting from taking a flight will have flights destination as the current location and flights arrival time as the current time. The goal test will check that are we at the final destination. And the path cost depends on monetary cost, waiting time, flight time, seat quality, etc. So these are the problem formulation steps for the airline travel problem. Next example is touring problem. The touring problem is about visiting multiple cities at least once while finding the best travel route. The goal is to cover all locations efficiently, often minimizing travel cost or distance. Here the agent must check whether it is back in the initial city and has visited all the 20 cities at least once. The solution of this touring problem is used in real world scenarios such as delivery services, road trips and tour planning. The challenge is to decide the best order to visit the cities without unnecessary travel. A famous example of this touring problem is the traveling salesman problem or the TSP where a salesperson must visit every city exactly once and return home. The problem formulation steps of this touring problem is shown over here which are self-explanatory. The next example is a traveling salesperson problem which is also called TSP in short. It is a touring problem and it is about finding the shortest possible route to visit each city exactly once and return to the starting point. The goal over here is to minimize total travel distance or cost. It is used in delivery services, circuit design and logistics. And since 
there are many possible routes finding the best one is computationally difficult so this tsp is a well known np hard problem in computer science see the full form of np hard is non deterministic polynomial time hard problem it refers to a class of computational problems that are at least as hard as the hardest problems in np that is non deterministic polynomial time see various algorithms such as brute force algorithm dynamic programming or held carp algorithm and approximation algorithms such as greedy algorithm genetic algorithm and colony optimization algorithm etc are used to solve it efficiently and the problem formulation steps of this tsp is similar to the turing problem which is shown over here next example is the vlsi layout design problem this vlsi layout design requires positioning of millions of components and connections on a chip to minimize area minimize circuit delays minimize stray capacitances and maximize manufacturing yield the vlsi layout problem is a complex optimization problem that requires intelligent placement and routing strategies heuristic and ai based algorithms for example genetic algorithms simulated annealing and neural networks are often used to find near optimal solutions and the problem formulation steps are shown over here next example is the robot navigation problem see robot navigation is a generalization of the route finding problem rather than a discrete set of routes a robot can move in a continuous space with an infinite set of possible actions and states for a circular robot moving on a flat surface the space is essentially two dimensional but when the robot has arms and legs or wheels that also must be controlled the search space becomes multi dimensional and advanced techniques are required to make the search space finite the problem formulation steps are shown over here so the main objective over here is the efficient movement of the robot in a continuous space while avoiding obstacles next example is automatic assembly sequencing whose main objective is to efficiently assemble components in the correct sequence so for this problem we have to specify an order in which to assemble the parts of the same object if the wrong order is chosen there will be no way to add some part later in the sequence without undoing some of the work that is already done so the goal over here is full assembly completed without errors or missing parts and the last example is internet searching whose objective is to efficiently find relevant information on the internet using minimal resources in recent years there has been increased demand for software robots that perform internet searching looking for answers to questions for related information or for shopping deals the searching techniques consider internet as a graph of nodes or pages connected by links and the final goal is to find the desired information so such many complex problems are there in real world which can be solved using different search algorithms so that is all for this video class thank you very much